chamber of museum, isn't it? Well, it's, it's, uh, it's the chamber at the museum. Chamber at the museum. Yeah. Yeah. Would you, okay. I'll let you fly with it. Go on. <laughs> Jonathan, we are at the chamber at the museum. Can you tell us a bit more about it and your role here? Yeah, well, I created the Museum of London, which is uh, Britain's uh, movie museum, uh, right in the heart of uh, London. Uh, we've got 45,000 square foot of uh, space dedicated to uh, films, predom predominantly the, the British film industry. The chamber forms part of the museum, which was the ex-debating chamber of the GLC, Greater London Council. It's the most fantastic 200-seat auditorium that we're very, very fortunate to uh, be able to... Uh, to, uh, to use as part of the museum, and uh, we're trying to create this uh, new form of theatre, which is great. And um, what do you do? What do you do here? Uh, that's a very good question, but <laughs> predominantly um, I curate and I uh, create new exhibits. Um, but uh, I originally had a, a, a collection of uh, movie props, um, which was uh, it's probably a little bit unnatural um, sort of collection of movie props, and uh, turned into a film museum. So the movie props that you've got are all originals from the film. Can you tell us a bit more about the props that you've got here that people could see? If they can yeah, I mean, our uh, original company was a prop hire company for the film industry. And what we've done is we've created a story around that. So when you first come into the, movie, uh, to, into the museum, you're taken back before, uh, before film and there's a lot of sort of iconic uh, sort of presence there and sets that, um, that are there to... to uh, to let the visitor know that there's a, a lot of history behind England and film. Uh, so the first thing you'll see is, is one of the, it's, it's a replica set, but it's, it's a set from uh, uh, Star Wars New Hope with C-3PO and R2-D2 standing there that you can have your picture taken with. And you're taken on a journey, you've got the original rank gong there from Pinewood Studios, which is really fantastic and really fortunate to have. History of the British Studios, a lot of them unfortunately not with us anymore, but um, sort of brings you all the way up to sort of your Pinewoods and your Shep Shepperton's, which uh, fortunately still are. Then on a journey through how films are made, from, from script all the way to screen, uh, from the art departments, breaking down the uh, model making and, and animatronics and sound and all that kind of stuff. Then genres, a lot of original props, including uh, the original 1978 Superman costume, Christopher Reeve wore in... Uh, in, in uh, in, in, in the epic, that. yeah, which is fantastic with a lot of sort of set drawings and set photographs and that kind of thing. And we've also got uh, original costumes from gladiators and original uh, weapons and armour from Zulu. And, and this, it's just a whole journey through, the, through cinema from, from script to screen, really. So how did you come from the transmission... Uh, transmission um from the right? transition even <laughs> i'll get my words out That's right. from cinema to theater well the whole idea about the museum is uh, first and foremost it is a movie museum um, but it's also a center for film and theatrical uh, arts um, so obviously theater a lot of uh, a lot of uh, talent comes from the theater that end up on the screen and and like and vice and versa, versa. Um, so we're trying to create this whole sort of uh, centre of, of arts and, and, uh, and, a, and a stage really where people can sort of feel at home to perform and obviously we're giving uh, an opportunity to, to the production company to be able to come here and it's all quite relaxed and, and uh, yes there's a business side but predominantly it is about um, encouraging um, this kind of sort of new wave of, of, of sort of fringe theatre uh, to get that sort of mix between the sort of West End and the Fringe. So, so we're quite excited about really it. Really quite a nice yeah, band. So, who, yeah. so how were you first approached then about the David Copperfield production that we're promoting today? Well, we have, uh, we have a, an in-house theatrical department and they've got a big circle of friends and, and people get to know about the, about the, the theatre and stuff like that. So we were introduced to Adam, who's a great guy and, and uh, a real go-getter. And I, I kind of sort of see a little bit of myself in him and that's, that's something where you know that that was everything really and the fact that it's the time of year it's perfect content for, for the museum as well and you know to have right in the heart of London right opposite Parliament and stuff like that is, is it's exciting we're looking forward to it. Have you seen it so far? I've seen the rehearsals but I've sort of saved saved myself for the uh, for the press night tonight. It should be it should be a really good yeah, one. Yeah. And how long is it running for? Six weeks. Six weeks. Yeah. yeah. So uh, well, the very best of luck with it. Thank you and very much. With the museum. Thank you very and, much. And um, let's hope we'll see what happens in the future. That's right. Thank you <laughs> Thank very, you very much. much Thanks a lot. Take Bye. care.